We're at Lincoln Financial Field right now covering the Cherry and White game. Later on in our show, we're going to try and solve the mystery of who this guy is right here. Owl Sports Update starts now. With these new bats the Temple is playing with, they've only hit seven home runs this season, comparing that to a full season of 41 home runs in 2010. Red Sox were kind of the lovable losers and it made you want to root for them even more. And somebody asked me one time, they said, would you give up the, the Vince Lombardi trophy for a World Series ring? <clears throat> and I said I'd give them both up in a heartbeat because the Red Sox mean that much to, you know, not only me, but to other fans. Being that we've run through some rough times here in, in Michigan, yep. the yep. whole state of Michigan, yep. you know, we are the Motor City and we've suffered yep. a lot yep. more than other states have, but, mm -hmm. but when the Tigers are playing well, yep. it, it gives people a little bit of a distraction uh, for two and a half, three hours uh, every time they're listening to a baseball game. You had the so-called race riots and those things are history, but thank God for baseball, uh, whether you were black, white, or Latino or whatever it was, uh, baseball took care of that. I'm Tom Chapman, and this is the Temple News. From the Leah Corps Center, from Resnick Court at Pearson and McGonagall, reporting from Skip Wilson Field, I'm Tom Chapman, Owl Sports Update.